You know R.L. Stein as in Goosebumps? Well, he has a brand new comic series called The Graveyard Club. This takes place in a creepy town that is surrounded by graveyards and there's a bunch of weird supernatural things constantly going on. And this is about a group of friends who call themselves The Graveyard Club. Kind of reminds me of The Breakfast Club, but spookier. And now they're going up against the town bully, his dad who's a cop, and they're uncovering a supernatural mystery. Definitely check this one out. There's a lot of content in this first issue and it has a spine, which means you can put it on a bookshelf. Also a little tip for you, if a comic book has a spine, you could usually also find it at a bookstore. If you haven't figured it out already, it's New Comic Book Day with Boom Studios. Jim Henson's The Labyrinth in comic book form? Let's talk about it. This is a brand new series. This is the first ever comic book adaptation of the novelization of the original movie written by N.C.H. Smith. This includes scenes and moments that are not at all in the movie. So this is a great expansion of the movie. This is Sir Issue 2. It has manga vibes and it's actually about motorcycle jousting. This is about a boarding school that has a secret. Yes, they have a jousting club that everybody bets on. It's like a whole thing. This is about now ex-girlfriends Avery and Nico. And Nico's now at this boarding school and has for some reason ghosted Avery and so she follows her to the school, which is fair. It's valid. I would do the same. And Avery soon discovers that Nico is heavily involved in the dangerous underground world of motorcycle jousting. Last issue, Nico bet everything she had to win this tournament. And for the first time, she actually has lost. And this issue starts with her in the metal wing and now somebody is taking on the mantle of her motorcycle jousting persona Aries so who is the new Sir Aries this is good for fans of motor crush as well as I heart skull crusher every time you break the law no matter how small even something as small as jaywalking every time you lie or make a misdeed you slowly transform into a monster until you lose yourself completely this is lawful issue four and I'm absolutely loving this series the main character Sung is faced with an impossible decision he has spent his whole life trying to be perfect so he can maintain his status in the inner circle to make sure that his mom has access to medicine and now he has to choose between protecting himself and his mom and following the law or actually doing the right thing. And he has uncovered a big secret about the ruling class. Last issue ended on insane terms. I don't want to give too much away, but this explores moral superiority and being lawful versus actually being good. This has been New Comic Book Day with Boom Studios. I'm here at Things From Another World, a local comic book shop in Los Angeles. Find a local comic book shop near you and uh, check out some great comics. When you buy these comics as they come out monthly, it really helps support the series. Anyway, read more stuff. I'll see you later.